Hello YouTube, this is Dragonheart and welcome to my YouTube channel and welcome to a brand new campaign for my channel and this is going to be an attempt to try and get the This Is Total War achievement on Steam. Nobody has got it as far as I'm aware. Um, I'm going to play this on Legendary and I'm going to play a Sparta. Never played on Legendary before, so let's bring this right up to Legendary and start the campaign. I won't talk through the intro video as well. Never played on Legendary, like I just said. Um, as far as my Total War experience goes, I I don't usually play on Legendary, so this is going to be a big challenge for me. It probably won't be a long series um, if I get wiped out early on. Probably be one, two, three videos, but we'll see how it goes. It's, it's a big challenge to take up, but it was one which I was reading about on the forums recently. I thought, you know what, that would make a good video to make, so this is what I'm going to try and attempt with Sparta. And the reason I picked Sparta is because I haven't actually played a campaign with Sparta on this game yet. So um, I've tried Rome, I've tried Carthage, I've tried Parthia, um, Swaby and Iceni, but I haven't actually played a Sparta yet. So here we go. This should be a very, very interesting campaign indeed. And we are about to begin as soon as the loading screen finishes. As far as I'm aware, for the, to get this, this achievement. Oh. The people of Epirus are fools. Having utterly failed to conquer Rome, they crawl back and presume to conquer Greece. To try is not to win. They will know this when you meet them in battle. Macedon may join you, but they are no better in the end. Alexander's conquests have left them with delusions of grandeur. They will be checked, as will every other aggressor. You may fare better working with Athens and other true Greek states, but history has often taught otherwise. Ultimately, trust only in Sparta, and you will prevail. So there we are, that's the opening uh, cinematic, I guess I can say, for that. Um, as far as I'm aware, with trying to achieve this Steam achievement, you have to declare war on every nation within the game the turn you meet them. So the very first thing I am going to do is go on to Diplomacy and we're just going to wage war on every I single person. I am here to listen if you speak declare honestly. War. Truth will be your... There we are. Athens are at war with us now straight away. Egypt, they actually like us. I it's, will it's almost a shame. All respect to the declare words war. You speak and... Cyprus are now at war with us as well. Only the jackals and carrion birds. I only Nossos left to go. Greetings, honored Declare guest. War. I serve. Right, so let's just double check that I now. Your people will long Macedon, your Egypt, name, Athens, Epirus, you inflict today. Cyprus, and Nossos all at war with me. They are all the current factions. So there we are. We're at war with everybody in the game so far on our map. And we're about to begin this legendary campaign to try and achieve. That's your command this very prestigious steam award i don't like my <laughs> my hopes at this campaign to be honest with you i'm not the best when it comes to total war i'm okay you know i i think i'm fairly average as a player i don't usually play legendary i usually play hard or very hard so this will definitely provide a big challenge for me but it's one i am relishing a lot and first thing we're going to do is recruit some units what we got we got perioikai pikemen Perioikai Hoplites, Perioikai Spears. Uh, the Spears are the cheapest. Oh my god, look at that. The Pikemen are quite low on weapon damage, even though they cost a lot of money. So the Hoplites or the Spears, I'm going to go with two units of Spears and a unit of Perioikai Hoplites. To begin with, I have an army over here as well, which could do with. Some Perry I Cry Spears. It's a good life. We'll have a Helot Slingers as well. We have a spy which we can actually use. We'll bring my spy forward to Athens. Athens is logically going to be my first target in this campaign. Um, Ares Dread. I should probably name my, my armies. Commander. Terror of Phobos and what else we got? The Cyclops of Slayers. I'm going to. We hunger I'm going to rename battle. these. I don't know what to rename them though. Um, I tell you what, I'll rename this army, and then if I do get the part two, let me know in this part what you would like me to name the Cyclops layers, and I will rename them 
whatever gets the most comments or whatever my favorite comment is. Um, what can I name this unit? This uh, army. The Terror of. Um, I could just go with something like this. The Terror of Hades. Well, that'll do for now. The Terror of Hades. Um, I can't really do anything apart from that. <laughs> we have a garrison of eight. Three Perioikai Hoplites. Three Spartan Youths. Two Helot Slingers. I could probably bring this army forward, but I don't want to lose my general straight away. At least if I get defeated here, I do have something to attack from there. Um, Athens is a big city to try and take. For some reason it's not letting me see Athens. There we go. It has ten garrisons, plus two ships, plus five units there and four units there, so I wouldn't take so Athens. Well, then turn. <laughs> Oh, and um, this is technology. Right, we're going to need some technology in this campaign. We'll just get logistics to begin with. That provides me with the Perioikoi camp. And we'll end turn there. In this first episode of this legendary campaign. And we have our first battle. 510 against 1,410. I don't stand a chance in this battle. I'm going to retreat. <laughs> because at least I have my reinforced army. There we go gives me a chance at least to build a couple of units in my first turn. I'm going to have to play this pretty smart. I can't go throwing armies away on legendary difficulty when I'm trying to get this achievement. So, new turn. First thing we need to do, check diplomacy again. One thing to keep doing is to keep checking. I haven't discovered any more factions, so we're at war with everybody. But the minute I see a new faction pro crop up, I need to declare war straight away. Um, Epidemic, yeah, we're over them. We're over with everybody at the moment. And we are, as you can see, building up slowly. We have eight units here, and we have five units here. Um, we do have a fair bit of money. We can actually. What's this? What? Unfinished building is damaged. How can it be damaged? Oh my god, right. We need to get these kind of uh, buildings at the moment. Spartan Hoplites I can get with that building. Um, what can I do with this turn? I need to build up my army. That's the main we thing anyway. Build up my army. So I have eight battle. units here, which is great. I'm going to recruit some more units battle. here. Um, I'm looking what the stats are. The Hoplites and the Spearmen. So Spears have less melee attack. They have slightly better charge bonus. They have... Um, better defense, melee defense. They don't have as good as armor, they don't have as good as health or base morale, so it's not much between them really. I will go with a couple of Hoplite um, units then, plus, us. let's see, Javelinmen and Slingers. I think Slingers, missile damage is a lot better on Javelinmen, range is better on Slingers. I will go to two Javelinmen then and two Slingers to build this army up. And I think we'll end turn again. And then I'll probably close this episode, be a quick episode to begin with, because I want to try and get past at least one episode in this series. So I hope you all understand that, and yeah, this is going to be a very interesting campaign. We'll definitely have some battles in future parts. Logistics has been researched, sabotage attempt, oh, little bastards. Um, Quartermaster's report, Let's just do our technology, so what can we do? We can have this, which will enable some more buildings for me. So we'll do that straight away. Um, this has been... I'm not sure what's happening, to be honest with you. If I get this, I get... a garrison of Perioikai, Hoplites, and Helot Slingers. Plus I can recruit Archers and Peltas, which would be very, very beneficial for me in this campaign. So my main aim is probably going to be boring the first kind of 10 minutes or so of this campaign. It, within these videos, I'm just going to try and recruit as much as I can with all of these um, these armies that I have at my disposal. Um, we'll go with a couple more javelin units here. Serve? And I'm going to end the episode there. So I hope you've enjoyed this very quick opening episode of this campaign. We're going for the t This is Total War Achievement with Sparta on Legendary Difficulty. Hope you've enjoyed this episode. I've been Dragonheart, and until next time, goodbye.